I don't need Sam Altman in my dishwasher, you know? Yeah, yeah, I can buy, I can buy that this is in route to local LLMs in a way that you need to like house your own data. You don't need that many GPUs to do that. That's not what this project right. is, right? This project right. is a hyperscaled, you know, frankly, advertisement for, hey, look at this mm-hmm. cool thing I'm doing. And right. here, let me show this thing that is inherently meant to be for security purposes on the internet. There's a bit of a right. conflict there if that really is a centralized goal, right? Like, I mean, yeah, I sure. The goal here is eyeballs, like, I mean, to be frank. Mm-hmm. But in the reality, in the like, you know, purely optimist view of this, sure, I can buy I can buy local AI models. And like, we don't want our data leaking to the model provider that's, you know, open AI or Google or whatever. I, I think that's reasonable. I think to go to this extreme is, is that is not. You know, I do think there, are, there are cases, I, I don't know how many people I've met who are doing this sort of thing, because it is like hardware is hard. And I think like enterprise is also boring. And I think there's a small overlap of people who want to deliver enterprise things to like enterprise things that are hardware. Like that's just like a, there's a rare category of people who are excited to do that. But there are people I know who like, they are trying to toy with legal AI or something. And instead of trying to solve like the security problem by saying like, okay, we're going to go get SOC 2 and build software or whatever. Like what they're shipping is like a brain box that runs inside mm-hmm. of that office, basically. Yep. Um, again, hardware is hard. Enterprise is boring. There's not too many people who like that overlap, but like there are people doing that where like if what PewDiePie made is something that like, Again, I don't think he's in any universe where he wants to start selling these or scaling his startup or something. But in some universe, like I could imagine that if you were to produce these boxes at scale or something and they're able to do very quality ChatGPT like things and they were tuned for some legal workflow or some healthcare workflow, like you could probably sell that as a company. Like you just need supply chains to be worked out and manufacturing to be like worked out. And that, that product has a lot of space to run, I think. 100%. Yeah. Like this is the perfect print. compute cluster works. This yeah. is the perfect AI product for a big hardware company that has not yet figured it out, figured out AI. A company mm. that's got great design, feel, and touch, has great distribution, and knows how to put compute in people's homes and in their pockets. This is Apple's AI mm. play. You, d- you just came up with it. You put yeah. a big box of compute in somebody's house, you sell it to them like you sell them a, a Mac on their desktop, but it's just got a ton of compute, right? Like, what do we, right. what do we have now? We, like, we all buy local compute in our pockets, on our desks, we use local power. We use local internet. All of these things could just be naturally extended with local LLM with a little bit more hardware. Um, and all you need to do is take an, an open source model, add some local GPU power focused on on just this problem. Mm. Apple's next uh, trillion dollar market cap increase. 